Hello, pre-K. Today, we are going to do something super, super, super special. Okay, we are going to do the Hebrew letter of the week. But let me tell you why this Hebrew letter is super, super special. Can anybody guess why this Hebrew letter is super, super special? Because it's the last Hebrew letter of the Aleph Bet. We did Aleph Bet, Gimel, Dalet, Hey, Vav, Zayin, Chet, Tet, Yud, Kaf, Chaf, Lamed, Mem, Nun, Samach, Ayin, Pei, Pei, Sadi, Kuf, Resh, Shin. And today we are going to do Taf, the last letter of your Aleph Bet notebook. Okay, Taf makes the sound t, 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 like a T. Okay, the pictures here are a tapuz. Tapuz is an orange Torah, which a lot of you have in your home. Torah starts with a taf. And a tinok. Can you tell what a tinok is? No, it's not sleeping, but a tinok is a baby. Tinok is a baby. So, tapuz, orange, Torah, tinuk, all start with a tough t, t. Now, I don't have the Aleph Bet book that I was reading from, but I was thinking, what can I do to show you some things that you might even have around your home that start with a tough? And I started to think, well, I showed you Torah already. Upside down, Torah, give it a kiss. And I showed you Tinok is a baby. Can you say Tinok? Good. Then I have this. Can you tell? This is an apple, but how do we say it in Hebrew? Tapuach. An apple is a tapuach. I have another thing that has the same name. A little bit different. This is a potato. This is called tapuach adama. It's an apple of the ground. That's how they call it in Hebrew. Tapuach adama, but it starts with a taf also. Tapuach etz. Etz is a tree. Tapuach adama. Adama is the ground because potatoes grow in the ground. So we have Torah, Tinok, tapuach etz. Tapuach Adama, and I'm sure all of you have this at home also. Your daddies put it on every single day, and that is tefillin. Can't see it so well, but tefillin is something black that your daddies will wrap around their arm, and they'll put something on their head before they daven and say tefillah. Every single morning, tefillah is prayer, when we pray to Hashem. All those things start with tough. Okay, now the tough yoga pose, our last yoga pose is, she kind of looks like she's crawling. You have to get on your knees and get on your hands and make the tough pose. Send me your tough yoga pose pictures. And you can color in your tough and put your last Hebrew letter into your Aleph Bet notebook. I'm so proud of you all, Pre-K. We finished the Aleph Bet. That calls for a celebration. I'm so, so, so proud of all of you. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Don't forget to send me pictures. This is huge. Send me pictures of your last letter. Have a great day, everybody.